Hey guys, Starcaster here, and welcome to Darkest Dungeon. This game is a turn-based dungeon crawler where you and your party of mercenaries dwell deep into the darkest of dungeons to fight the most sinister creatures to achieve the ultimate purpose. Enjoy the cutscene. Ruin has come to our family. You remember our venerable house? Opulent and imperial, gazing proudly from its stoic perch above the moor. I lived all my years in that ancient, rumor-shadowed manor, fattened by decadence and luxury. And yet I began to tire of conventional extravagance. Singular unsettling tales suggested the mansion itself was a gateway to some fabulous and unnameable power. With relic and ritual, I bent every effort towards the excavation and recovery of those long-buried secrets, exhausting what remained of our family fortune on swarthy workmen and sturdy shovels. At last, in the salt-soaked crags beneath the lowest foundations, we unearthed that damnable portal of antediluvian evil. Our every step unsettled the ancient earth. But we were in a realm of death and madness. In the end, I alone fled laughing and wailing through those blackened arcades of antiquity. Until consciousness failed me. You remember our venerable house. Opulent and imperial. It is a festering abomination. I beg you, return home, claim your birthright, and deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadows of the darkest dungeon. Wow, this game, the, the theme and the eerie feeling it gives off is so... Uh, I want to say rewarding, but it's not really the word. It's just so overwhelming, immense, immersive. Uh, Darkest Dungeon is about making the most of a bad situation. Quests will fail and must be abandoned. Heroes will die, and when they die, they stay dead. Progress saves automatic automatically, so actions are permanent. And then if you guys want to read the rest, go ahead. Uh, I should have read that right off of the hat. But man, this game, the music, the gameplay, the way that the, the time the game is set in, the... the the theme of the game, it is so overwhelming, so immersive, and I love this game. Uh, it's all about darkness, and it's, in its own way it's scary, but it's not really scary. The characters, you get so attached, and we'll get into that. But let's get this started. Campaign, click alert to begin. Radiant, more like, kind of like easy mode for you, uh, those of you who are first dark, first experience players. Uh, darkest, the original settings for the game, the game, the way the game is meant to be played, and that's hardcore mode. Uh, no thank you. <laughs> We're gonna go with darkest because hardcore, uh, hardcore mode, uh, it locks some gameplay settings, and I don't know what that is, uh, what gameplay settings it locks, but I'm not gonna delve into that. Instead, we'll go into darkest, we'll play the game the way it's meant to be played. Dungeon. Darkest Dungeon. We'll play the game the way it's meant to be played. Here for the experience and the game. If you're looking for a game that's going to throw you, you will a arrive curveball, along the old road and give you a hard time, this is the game you want to be playing. Serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside, leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient, pitted cobbles of the old road. And on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. So steel yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. Ooh, I love 
love those cutscenes. The feeling this game gives me, I just, I just love it. It really puts me in the game, makes me feel like, like I, I am responsible, legitimately, for these characters in the game. I want them to live, you know. All right, here's our two starting characters: Reynold, map navigation, click to move, uh, also WSP, and uh, this Moss, our Crusader, and then a Highwayman. Now let's get started. Okay, we click the room to move to the next. Brigands room. have run up these lanes. Keep to the side path. The hamlet is just ahead. Dispatch this dog in Our brutal fashion that all may Kill hear the of enemy. Your Turn based. All right. All right. These are our abilities. What we have here is HP and stress. You guys know what HP is, but stress. Stress is the sanity levels of your heroes, or mercenaries is what they're called. Having uh, having stress is okay, having too much stress is really bad. So as you see, it's zero out of 200. Well, the problem with that is if they get to 100 halfway, they have a chance of going crazy or achieving uh, what I like to joke about is uh, Nerva or whatever, the, the Buddhist, I don't know, Nirvana. Uh, basically, what it means if they, if they become heroic or achieve nirvana is they redeem themselves, their stress goes back down to like 0 or 10 or 20, and uh, they get this buff that buffs the entire group, which is really, really good. But that's very unlikely to happen. But if their stress gets to 100 and they don't get that, they will freak out and have a really, really negative effect on the group, which is also really bad. So let's, let's kill this guy. I'm tired of him waiting around. Gave him a bleed. He's gonna get to attack, uppercut slice, two damage. Very cool. I'm gonna smite him. Get smited! As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. And we get blue. Alright, cool. 1,000 gold. Move it on! This is a torch. Uh, the torch. You wanna keep the torch lit. Uh, the, the less of a torch you have, the. Uh, I'm more unlucky you'll be, and the worse off you'll be. Leave nothing unchecked. There is much to be found in forgotten places. You see, it's a uh, 70, and now we get plus stress. Plus An plus ambush. Stress. Send these vermin a message. The rightful right. owner Out of these has abilities, returned, tracking and shot, it's a buff. No Grape shot, welcome. it's a group effect. Pistol shot, it's like, I don't like a snipe, and open veins of fleet attack. Um, the big guys count as two. I'm gonna go for the guy in the back. So we'll get him. Executed. 11 damage, and that helped the sanity. Like in fire, 2 damage. And the debuff. And we're gonna try to do a stunning blow. We don't want this big guy to get off his attack. Now he's stunned and he can't attack this round. Moving on, we're gonna use our Grape Shot Blast to hopefully kill him and do a little bit of damage to the, uh, the big guy. Continually onslaught. We would like it to be the other Destroy way, but that's good. Them. Corpses. When a monster oh. dies, they leave corpses act as temporary obstacles and will eventually go away on their own. You can attack them or remove them faster, or be even better, use range skills or push and pull skills. Uh, even special, cor even special corpse clearing skills that some heroes possess. Uh, monsters kill with bleed, light, or crits leave no corpse at all, which is awesome. Can be very helpful sometimes. Alright, let's get rid of this guy. Rain of whips. Bleed attack. Yep. We both got it. One damage per round. We got some blade of our own there, fellas. Outmatched. Point blank shot. Oh, snap. That hurt. Finish him off. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Uh, continue adventuring. Is there anywhere else to go? No. Bandage, trapped chest. We don't have anything to maybe. We'll just risk it. Trapped. Alright, we're out of here. Quest rewards 5,000. Food, food. This is stuff we can that we sell back. And some collected heirlooms, which help up you upgrade your gear and whatnot. Let's see, 
Weapon Tinker, that's good. And Beast Slayer, that's really good. Minus 20% weapon upgrade cost, that's good. Awesome. Moving to Welcome Hamlet. home, such as it is. This squalid hamlet, these corrupted lands, they are yours now, and you are bound to them. These are our quests we need to complete, and these are, like, just roster these guy quests, which is basically get them to max, get it all uh, classes to max level, level 6, which is okay. First week, we got Dismas and Renault. And we escorted them to the hamlet. Now let's look at the hamlet. Get help where you may. Each. Okay, I'll let you guys look at that. Moving on. This is the stagecoach where we recruit new people. Women and men, soldiers and outlaws. Uh, play doctor, Fools okay. and corpses. And at each party, you cannot do a mission All unless you will find their way people. to us now that the road is clear. Uh, graveyard, followed heroes. Most will end up here. Covered in the poisoned earth, and awaiting a merciful right. oblivion. Uh, uh, ancestors memoirs. In time, Our you will ancestor. know the tragic extent of my failings. Killed himself when he sent the letter, apparently. I just realized that he did kill himself. I didn't see the gun the, the very first time I played through the game. Well, not played through, but uh, played the game. And uh, just like now, I noticed that he actually killed himself. I was like, what was that gunshot for? And, uh, wow, I just, it really got to me. I was, I just was really surprised by it. Is Hamlet, uh, I guess we'll embark. Let's get our next quest going. A mecca of quest madness parties. and Looking morbidity. Quest parties, details, drag heroes into slots. All right, begins. let's look at our heroes, our heroes, uh, abilities real quick. God-fearing, in town will only pray for stress relief. That's bad. Uh, and prone to stealing items. That's not good. Kleptomaniac. That is really bad. But he is a warrior of light, plus 10% of damage and towards above 75 in uh, Beast Slayer, which is really good. This boss, known cheat, is not allowed to gamble, stun resist, more speed, less weapon upgrade costs. Okay, let's get their abilities. Uh, he has Smite, which is a basic attack, uh, Zelius Accusation, which does damage to two people. Stunning Blow, which stuns, and Blow Up for Faith, which is a self-buff, and it adds to the torch. Moving on to our Highwayman, he has Pistol Shot, which is a snipe. Grape Shot, which is damage to all enemies. Tracking Shot, which is a self-buff, and Open Vein, which is a bleed. And we have our Plague Doctor here. He has Blinding Gas, blunt, which is a blind, Plague Grenade, Blight, and Blight, and self-buff. And uh, Holland, which is our... Let's go white. Uh, which is our healer, our Vestal. Improved stress reduction while meditating and while camping. Plus 5% virtue chance. Which is the, uh, when she has 100 stress, she either has a chance to become heroic or not. That's virtue. Uh, kleptomaniac as well. It's not good. It's really not good. Alright, and uh, we didn't look at needs to be there. We didn't look at his. He has Precise Striker, plus 3% crit for melee, and he doesn't even have any melee abilities. Gambling, and will not meditate. Okay, that's okay. Let's make our group then. Tank up front, put our guy right there. Vestal, the usual suspects. As you guys can see, it's a, it's a basic game build. Like, good cop, bad cop. The game has specific builds, which is like meta. Uh, for ways you can go with all your heroes. And it has a little, like, cute little unique names for it, which is funny. And these are difficulties. Uh, we have level two level ones and two level zeros. Uh, so they could do all the easy stuff, but let's say you click, like, the hardest, uh, one, which is the ultimate dungeon we need to do. The ultimate, uh, man, I just said at the beginning of the video, uh, the ultimate purpose, which is to complete this dungeon, uh, kill the shuffling horror. And it's hard, and they're like, oh my god, do you not send me into that? Nah, well, we won't make them. They, and they are willingly wanting to do the easy stuff, because they're that's what they are for. Anyways, let's get started. Let's get down the into it. The cost of preparedness. 
measured let's now provision. in gold. We're in the runes. Later. So let's just bring some blood. food. And torches. We'll take four food. Actually, we're not gonna take any food. I think we'll get food. Uh, six torches. Go for eight torches. And one key. Yeah, that's it. I think we'll be provided everything else. At least eight food for the quest, but I believe we will get food. I believe strongly that food will be given to us. Let's to continue. Hero panel. Oh wow. I like the background there. Alright, let's get moving. Everyone's a little stressed already. It's not good. Alright, free torch looks like. Yep. Awesome. Take it. Also, you want to keep this, you want to keep that high. Our first opponents. Oh, we got surprised. That's not good. Uh, it didn't mess up the two for the formation that bad. Executed oh, with it impunity. Did. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. And Noxious purpose gas. is made clear. Light, he's dead on his turn. So let's just put them back in the same. Yep. The slow death. Of course. Unforeseen. Awesome. Unforgiving. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. That's where everyone should be. Unlock strong box. Glittering gold. Shovel. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Um, I recommend you don't do this. I recommend you Even be, uh, the cold stone seems bent generous on preventing passage. With the resources you give your group. Um, this, this is like the tutorial mission. So I didn't really think I'd need to bring anything because it normally is all supplied. Okay, we're gonna do grape shot blasts since there's three of them. That's what I like to see. We're gonna get rid of that lady in the back. Hopefully. Do not want to see her. Doing anything. Confidence surges as the dead. enemy crumbles. She's gonna get to do something. Stressful incantation, that's what I was afraid of. But stressful incantation. It, it gives stress, and it takes away Torch, uh, which is really bad. Now he's at like 40. Should have done blinding gas on her. And now she should be dead. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. The other two didn't get to attack, though. Guys, what way? Oh, we're scouting. Okay, we'll go north first, and then we'll cut around. The torch, the light is fading. It greatly affects game mechanics. It makes the game harder, and but better rewards. So there is a way in the game where, like, you can have a nighttime party where you, they all they do stuff without torch whatsoever. Finally got something. But the, you'll have like you can get items and stuff, gear. Uh, and make them go without torch specifically because that's what they're meant their gear is okay hold the scrawler bone soldier and add light we want the lady in the back on good oh she dodged it that's good that's cool that's cool okay blinder for next round Ren for the old gods. And graveyard slash. Ooh, ouch, that hurts. Stunning blow. Let's give it to the golden crawler. Grape shot blast. Give it to him. Give it to him. Hopefully he gets it. He's dead. Death 
by inches. Five health, which is good. Kill her. Oh, she won't die. Grip shot last. Continually now she onslaught. Should. Oh, she's not. Destroy. Damn them it. All. Elder push. Okay, that's fine. Resist. Formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Victory! Alright. There's a chest here. Heirloom chest. A handsome reward. That's good. For a task we haven't got any performed. food, which is not good. Let's think if we get food. It's not happened. Oh, a trap. Okay, now that we know the trap is there, I know you need a bandage. This army traps. Oh, I should have had the highwayman do it. Damn it. Mind that such missteps are the exception, and not the rule. She dodged it, that's good. Alright, there's gonna be a fight in here. Surprise them even better. Grape shot blast. Not a good. Not a good start. Let's see if we can stun him. That's good. Oh, that hurts. Reeling. About to break. I should kill him. How quickly the tide oh, turns. Those crits are real. All right, gonna do another. Dodged it again. Uh, who gets it? As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Good, dodged it. Okay, let's get a little worried. Things can go wrong really fast. Be gone, fiend. Uh, she needs to stop healing for three and heal for five. You'll die in his turn. Slowly. Oh, eight damage. Gently. This is how a life is taken. It's not good. Oh, we had holy water, damn it. Holy items, you can use items on mountains and stuff to give you a better chance of getting loot and whatnot. And she steals it. She Hats stole it. Laden with loot Bitch. are often low on supplies. Damn kleptomaniacs. Go in the door. All right, I was, I was thinking we would get food, but none, no food. This is not good. Everyone's gonna hate me. Again? Again? Are you serious? A second time? That was there there was the food. Oh no. A second time in a row. Kleptomaniac. Gnawing hunger. You just ruined it for everybody. Turning the body against itself. I should have knew Weakening it. I should have known. You know what? We're gonna go one more. I know what's in that room, but fuck it. Injury and despondence set the stage for heroism. I know it's in this room. cowardice. But fucking, if she dies, she dies. <laughs> Tempting 
goblin. If they die, they die. I don't want them. Teetering on the brink, facing the abyss. Fucking terrible buffs. Death's door. My heroes are just zero HP. They're at death's door. Okay. Use the blinding gas on the two in the back. Stuns them both. Great guard slash dodge. Three damage is okay. We'll take it. Three damage to these front two. Actually, stunning blow, my lord. A singular Good strike. Crit. Grape shot blast. Decent hits. Heal the party. Two HP each. That's okay. Shoot at the. Don't want him. Shoot at him. Five damage. Oral Dungeon. Three damage is okay. We'll take three. Um, we'll go with the. Pulse Grenade? Yeah, we'll go with that. Blight work on both of them. Yes, it did. Deadliest Accusation. Kill the one in the second part of the line. Dead weight, that's gonna hurt a little bit. Put him back on death's door. A hand's breadth from becoming unwound. Oh, he's stunned, that's not good. Oh uh, well, we'll heal him. This fight's going really well. Tempting goblet, three damage. Okay, that will kill him. Kill the party. One health each. That's whatever. Coral food. Death door at the again. Very precipice Jeez. of oblivion. It's really not good. We'll get him to mark himself and make him the target. Make himself the target. Buff himself and mark himself. Mark Great is like is the weapon that it's like a taunt. It's, it's like, hey, attack me over here, kind of thing. But it doesn't work most of the time. Good dodge. I like to think in the ideal world that it will work, but uh, not really. Another good dodge. I love seeing that. I love seeing that. We kill him. And then have our container finish. It. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Whoa. That's tough. Finding the stuff is only the first Take all test. That. And that's it. We're out of here. Must be carried home. Still managed to pull it off with no food. Uh, I recommend, guys, you just always take food no matter what. Even if you're 100% positive you're gonna get some food, take a little. Don't go completely without food. Because you never know when one of your people might have kleptomania mania and steal it. Everyone got a little something. More bad than good. Healer's gift, plus 20% healing skills, intense craving for alcohol. Uh, really scared of humans, blight resist. Man. Can you feel it? The walls between the sane world and that Tavern is now unlocked. The yeah, of is now unlocked. Are tenuously thin here. Successfully completed your first foray into the ruins, week two. The ruins has been unlocked. Poland is now Prentice Vestal, Vavi, Vaviel. Vele, or something like that, is now an apprentice plague doctor. They were successful in exploring the ruins, level one short. Moving on. Let's recruit our new members. We got a jester and a leper. Let's take them. This man understands that adversity and existence are one and the same. Okay, we got a tavern. Fresh Stress. kegs, cards, and curtained rooms promise solace to the weary and broken alike. So, their stress levels are really high. This is how we're going to reduce their stress. So, 
Pavel is gonna go there. There and there. It costs money too. It's expensive as hell. Moving on from there, they're getting rid of their stress. We'll go the to the cobwebs Via. have been dusted. The pews set straight. The Abbey. The Abbey calls to the faithful. Uh, can't send them in because we got need to have two people. Uh, probably a bad idea sending this boss in. I think this is the group we'll have for our next encounter. But thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a comment or a like. I really love this game. This game is... It gets me going, guys. It really does. It's challenging. And if you want a challenge, this is the game you should be playing. This is the game you should be playing. If you just love a challenge, love a story, love the immersion, once again, guys, I'm sorry for rambling, but thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a comment or a like. Make sure to subscribe so you know when I put more content out. And click that notification button. I'll see you guys next time.